Beautiful solo Producer diverse. Leif Bristow and his wife Agnes Bristow have produced TV series such as Wildlife Quest and dramas like Rising Suns. Mr. Bristow is also a director at the Ontario District Council. They have attended Shenyun several times throughout the years. I always feel uplifted when I come to see a show. It's very rich in, in everything you can imagine. The music is so beautiful. But when I'm sitting in the audience, I feel like I'm transported somewhere else. I love this performance. It was, uh, it was quite exceptional. Uh, it was one of the most beautiful solos I've heard in a long time. It's really captivating. They watched the performance at the Mississauga Living Arts Center on January 12th in Canada. Besides watching a new production, the pair also watched a performance that showcased the choreography of the dances. The show was magnificent. I, I really enjoyed it. It was humorous. It was visually beautiful. The choreography is magnificent as always. I kept noting how, or noticing how beautiful and, and unique each dance sequence the wardrobe and costumes were. I mean, I think they've done them really elegantly. The, the blend of colors, the, the style of coloring, um, and, and, and just integrating the costumes into the dances is, is really beautiful. China maintained a culture built on beliefs from Buddhism, Taoism, and Confucianism. Ancient Chinese believed their culture was a gift from the heavens. According to its website, the traditional culture presented in Shenyun is the one thing that the current communist regime has systematically tried to uproot since it took power in 1949. It's such a different art form, especially for, you know, for, for audience, well, I think for most audiences around the world today, because you're, you're dealing with an art form that goes back so many, you know, so many thousands of years. You know, what the arts are supposed to do is, as beyond entertain, if through the arts we can open the imagination or ask, you know, cause people to have a question or, or to want to research or to learn more, then, then it's a great way to open the door for somebody who might go back, oh, I gotta go learn a little bit more about this or just go research that period. If, if, you, don't, if you don't research your history, you'll always fail in the future. History and tradition are, are, are important because it's those elements of our cultural history and, and who we are as a people that help us progress forward in the future and become what we convey to the world. NTD News, Canada.